No freaking way. Oh gosh. <laughs> That's either blood or lava. Hello everybody, Xandra Gamer, and today I'm playing uh, Detention, a uh, Japanese horror game. Uh, from there, as you can see, this is, I guess, a demo, or only has a certain amount of the game that you can play before you have to play the full version. Let's get in and have a look at it. I did say at the start that there's a lot of gore and graphic imagery in it, and also not the subject of people who have heart disease, so... No idea why the camera is going slow. But it's tracking terribly. Maybe because the game is taking up majority of the bandwidth. Let's see. Pass the following. Oh, pay attention. This will be on the final exam during this time period. Okay, that was way too fast. I'll try to read. Present then turned, started the northern expression. Look, it's an instructor body. So I didn't have an issue with somebody who's going to sleep. I have a word with you. Okay, class, let's take a short break. Miss Yang? Have you seen this list before? Okay, no one decided to wake him up? Huh? Did I fall asleep? This is strange. Where is everyone? How come no one's here? Typhoon warning? There shouldn't be any typhoons this time of year. What's going on here? This is my seat. Seat's pretty uncomfortable, but I use I'm used to it now. Oop, what's that? There's a note on the table. Where did Miss Ling go? Was ever pass was ever I was passing this note in class mm -hmm. was worried about Miss Yang. Jang calls keeps calling in sick lately. It's weird. No kidding, man. I hate those no those other subs they send in. A school anthem it's actually Decent melody lyrics somehow feel like another one of the propaganda. Modem. Okay. I'll put this in my notebook. Let's move that down just to see if there's a. Getting dark out. I should head home.
fucking Deku. Okay, fine. Ghost bathroom. Shouldn't go in there. Okay. I don't have to use a washroom. My restroom. Public announcement. Public announcement. Due to our ongoing war with main, with mainland China, Inspector Bai is asking students to write out anyone who is pro-communist or show signs of tyranny. There's big reward for informants. Oh, so in Taiwan. There's no uh, symbol there at the top. This is Mr. Ko's... They say Mr. Ko sometimes sleeps here. Oh, I missed that other part. Locked. Miss Co and Colonel Co, as we call, or Colonel Co as we call him, back behind his back is military veteran. This used to be a classroom. Then they changed it into half storage, half bedroom for our maintenance worker, Mr. Co. I think this is control panel to roll up the door. It's wiring. It's mechanism winch. There's instructions on the cover. I think I need a hand crank. Oh, that doesn't sound good. Oh, there's a hand crank there. See the hand crank. This is one dirty raincoat. That musty smell is horrifying. It's a kerosene heater. We used one last winter, huddling around it, trying to, and having a good time. Yeah, okay. I have the crank. Let's go. Our school is located halfway up the mountain. It's got a decent view scenery with fresh air. But it's in the middle of nowhere. Not the auditorium. From the front gate and route and there's a route down the mountain. Sure shoot back is to the auditorium. Sure. Not sure if that's a mistake all the way, but Oh, that doesn't look good. Hi.
Do I really want to go up there already? Hello? Wake up. You shouldn't be here. She shouldn't be here. I shouldn't be here. Uh, where am I? The auditorium. You were sleeping on the stage. Huh? School is canceled because of the cyclone. Because a cyclone is coming. Or typhoon, I should say. The cyclone. Typhoon? I just came from my class. You're the first person I came across. Weird. How did I... We should be... We should get going. It's getting dark in here. And the rain's starting to pour. And the wind! That wind! Wait! My necklace is gone. What? Have you seen my necklace? I don't think so. How? I must have lost it somewhere. I'm not leaving without it. Wait. What's this? Something odd. It's odd scene classroom chair over here. It's for a play. Hey, come back. Get downstairs. Come back, come back, come back, come back, come back. Where is it? How did I lose it? Do you need help finding it? Uh... Would it be too much trouble? Well, we should only find it faster if we look together. <laughs> Thank you, then. What kind of necklace are you looking for? A deer-shaped jade pendant tied to a red cord. Let's pull up and... <coughs> excuse me. Let's pull up and search for it, then. Thank you, it means a lot. Okay, you go that way, I'll go this way. Something odd. Some odds and ends. And an old military coat. Nothing special here. Fan. Old exhaust fan. The power is off. There's a dim sound coming from the end of the vent shaft. Something is in there. I can't reach it. You be over here then. This stuff is used during our school assemblies. There's an umbrella underneath the, in the bucket. Yes, take the bucket. No, take, yeah, take the bucket. Take the umbrella. Well, what good is a broken umbrella? I feel like John Wolf played this, but I'm not sure. But I saw this, I was like, oh, I'll give it a try. Okay, let's go to the fair end. What's it going to tell me? Is that the way to get out? That girl seems anxious about her lost gap. Okay. I don't think it's a good idea to leave her here. Maybe I can help. 
It's just called. Okay. Okay, so she's just wandering around there. Full-length mirror makes me want to double take if my shirt is tucked in. Double check. Exit. The side entrance is on. It's soon be night. We should get out. Okay, so I guess it's somewhere here. Is that what you're telling me? Oh, wait. Let me see if I can use the broken umbrella with the vent. Hey, it's a necklace. Well, that was easy enough. Is this the necklace? You found it! That's awesome! Thank you! Where did you find it? It was in the storage shed next to the storage room next to the stage. It seems like someone threw it into a vent in there. What? Why would it be in such a place? Don't forget it. You found it anyways. Let's get going before the rain's rain gets heavy. Sure. Wow, the rain's pretty heavy already. It's too dangerous to stay out any longer. Let's go. Age bonsai tree. It's probably been here long before people settled on the on this mountain. And boom, Chuck Wellington. This rock's been sitting here for quite some time now. People say it fell from a small temple on the mountain. This is security office by the main gate, I guess. Even the guards left for home. Here's the campus exit. What? The bridge collapsed. No freaking way. Oh gosh. <laughs> That's either blood or lava. Whoa, why is the river red? This looks like... It kind of looks like blood. Blood? Don't say that. Sorry, I wasn't thinking. What happened? 
It's okay. Okay, let's calm down and think about it. It's got to be a reasonable explanation. Hmm? Well, why is it red? Even muddy water should... Even muddy water shouldn't be this color. Yeah. Ah. I think I know what has caused this. <laughs> the fuel factory is located upstream. It's probably them dumping chemical waste into the river under cover of the typhoon. Well, that's a stretch. Are you sure? I've heard people talk about it. What people? Who's they? Perhaps you're right. The worst part is we shouldn't be... The worst part is we don't have a way to go downhill now. The bridge's gone. Tons of people cross this bridge every day. This bridge shouldn't be... Should have been better maintained. Guess we have to head back to school. It won't do us any good sitting... Won't be do us any good standing here in the middle of the rain. True. Don't worry, it's just a safe room. School has enough supplies for us to get through the storm. Or does it? Alright. I guess I can trust you. You you look you seem like a reliable person. Hell let's fall in sleep in class. Just try to be optimistic. Let's get going then. Sigh. All wet and tired. What a day. Just rest for now. We may have to spend the night here. Oh, wait. I haven't officially thanked you for finding my gla my, yeah, my glasses. My glasses! My necklace for me. I'm Faye Gray Shin. A senior from Miss Ying's class. You can call me Ray. How about you? What grade are you in? So you're my senior. Maybe you my senior. Miss Fang, I'm Ri Shang Ting. You don't have to be formal with me. It's a bit awkward. Just Ray is fine. Normally, we don't go to the senior building. I heard about, I heard that it's very competitive, a very competitive environment where everyone works their butts, the butts setting off. Huh, it's not that awful. Some of us still do what we want. I don't envy you for graduating. Soon you'll won't have to see I do envy you for graduating. So you won't have to see Yang Fung Yang yeah, Fung on a daily basis anymore. Instructed by I don't even dare call him by his full name. Rumor says he's a ruthless killer during the war. I won't dare do it in front of that. I don't dare do that in front of him either. We're pretty, we're all pretty terrified of him. We avoid him in all possible, possible way we can. Um. <clears throat> hey, hey, you, get out. Come here. Why are you hiding from me? Are you afflicted with? Cummies? With the cummies? Whoa! That was a perfect intim. Oh, that was. <laughs> she's supposed to be uh, mimicking the the current one, the inspector. Gave me goosebumps. Huh? Anyways, just hang tight, buddy. 
it'll till it'll be your turn to graduate next year. Sigh, life's a struggle. Hey, I know what to do. I know what we can do. Let me go use the phone in the principal's office. See if I can contact anyone. Then I'll grab the heater in the storage room and a couple of blankets from the health center. That should be enough for us to get through the night. That's a well thought plan. Do you need help? I'll be fine. I'll be fine on my own. You should <clears throat> rest up here. <clears throat> You miss us. That man's got it under. The man's got it under control. That doesn't work. Hold on there now. Don't take me as one of those spoiled, pampered girls. I'm probably more capable than most you boys. Sorry, that came out the wrong way. It's okay, you don't have to apologize. I know you were just trying to help. Well. Okay. Excuse me. Okay, how about this? <clears throat> I'll go make the phone call, then we'll find what we need and carry them back. Alright, that sounds good. I'll wait, right, I'll wait for you right here. Okay. So we're going to go make a phone call. Call me on the telephone. That's a fair where the principal's office is. <clears throat> nope, nope, nope. Nope, it's just that way now. Um, 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 that just went off on its own. His footsteps echoed softly, invoking a trace of suspicion in me. Reality faded away as time stood still. I swallowed hard as the emptiness confined, confined me. That's in there, I'll have to... Sorry, so now, this, that was just the first part, so that's what now I have to pay for. I think. So he's dead. Uh, why? What happened? It looks like he's not breathing at all. Same last words. Is he dead? Nope. Eyes open up. But how? He was just fine a moment ago. Oh my god, I just met you. Tell me this is only a bad dream. Okay, Ray, take a deep breath. There's a notebook on the stage. It's Ray's journal. Saw him looking through it earlier. Perhaps there are clues of what happened. Teller poem. Clues. Turn the wheel with the laws of universe to reveal the path. 
Jade necklace on him? No. Okay. Nope. It's too dark to see anything. That freaked me out a little bit. I should take this candle with me. It should light the way. Nothing here. Oh, I know this coat. Belongs to Mr. Co. Okay, well, I think we'll leave this episode here at zero ending point, and maybe we'll play it again. If you like me to play it again, certainly do a like, and maybe we will. It's Android Gamer, later days, and happy gaming!